Welcome back, guys. It's Kirak here, and welcome back to another episode of Bioshock Infinite. We are actually picking up right where we left off on the previous episode, simply because I don't think the game saved. So I'm going to keep playing, and I'll make this into another episode, and uh, hopefully when we hit a save point, I will end the episode. Hopefully not in the next, you know, 30 seconds. So what's this? Comstock fights the Serpent of Nations. Hmm... Okay. Salts. I can't pick it up. Nope. Oh, I love exploring the area, too. Look how dark and... Wow. Dreary this looks. Okay. What's this say? Order of the Raven. What the hell is that? Can't get that. Interesting. Sean Booth Wilkins. Okay. Or Wilkins Booth. I read it backwards. Cool. Somebody is there. What the hell is all this rotting food doing in here? Alright, let's go on this side first. I was looking at the food. A lot of dead stuff here, man. just so much to look at and so much to explore that I, I kind of miss the action <laughs> or vice versa. I'm in the action and I miss the environment. Let's, uh, yeah, coins. Let's head back. So I think that loops around. And now I can pick up the salts. We'll go upstairs afterwards. Wow. The amount of detail is just unbelievable. Nice. I was right, it did loop around. So let's head back to the front area, the foyer area, and go upstairs. Hmm. For God and country. Whoops. <laughs> oh, itchy trigger finger. <laughs> that was awesome. Now, a bunch of you are probably going to say, Oh, you're not supposed to kill him. You're missing the storyline. I don't know. We'll see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where is he? 
right here. All right, let's go downstairs. Oh, the other, um, the other time I was playing at the very beginning, I didn't realize that the bodies disappear, but they leave these little, uh, these little chests that have all the loot that the bodies had. So that's kind of cool. I like that. I didn't burn any of them. I should have burned some of them. Next time. Okay, let's go collect loot. That goes somewhere new. So, sorry for interrupting your uh, ceremony, guys. Oh, yes. What? Optional guess Hmm. Find, and so it's an optional quest. Find the lock that fits the key. Did that say find? Whoops. Find the lock that fits the key. Actually, let's go in here. And find the lock that fits the key. Interesting. An intrigue key. Okay. So, yeah. Um, you guys can leave... Uh, um, any comments if you guys see that I'm, I'm missing something totally that I can go back and grab something that I m maybe missed grabbing or if uh, I'm just not playing the game right <laughs> uh, feel free to comment uh, I I'm having fun um, but uh, either way you know just go ahead leave a comment let me know I read the comments here we go let's grab you uh, no can't grab that See? I think that's the coolest thing. Yes, yes. I know chests wouldn't materialize out of uh, wouldn't materialize out of nowhere in real life, but it's pretty cool. You still get a chance to pick up the loot. Okay, that goes up. Nowhere to go there, so we're going this way. Oh, I got a feeling I got to take that elevator. Before then arming himself and firing into an assemblage of virtuous bear goers. As of this hour, he is considered wholly responsible for causing at least eight God-fearing Colombians to meet their maker in heaven. Shut up. Push. Oh, sorry guys. Reload. Okay. I hear something mechanical. I'm not entirely sure I like that. Oh, okay. Whew. Uh, it looks like I'm full on everything anyways. Push this out of the way or something. Move, yes. Oh, yeah. Another item. Okay. I opened it up, but I'm going to take a quick peek around before I head in there. Watch me get killed. Okay. I'm not going there now. I imagine that's where I'm going to end up having to go in the end. Is that yes oh damn I can open the drawers I didn't even realize 
Oh, yes. Sweet mother of Columbia, why do we worship three symbols in your memory? We worship the sword so that we might avenge you. We worship the raven so that we might cover the city with eyes. We worship the coffin because it symbolizes the weight of our faith. Check it out. New pants. Firebird. Jump from a skyline has a 100% chance to burn nearby enemies. Oh, jumping from a skyline. Okay, victims take 400 damage over 3 seconds. Sure, take gear. So I'm going to go into the uh, menu and see if I can switch. Because I think I got pants last time. Can I go up and down? No, I can't go up and down. That's my ammo advantage strike. Like, I don't get that. Yeah. Those are my vigors. These are my voxophones. My goals. Yeah. Okay. Equip item. Equip item. Sorry, I'm just exploring. I just want to... Ah, here we go. So, Ghost Soldier killing with a Vigor Traps. <clears throat> a Vigor Trap has 70% chance. That's what that was. When I threw that uh, that other one uh, and it just hung around that area, uh, it was a Vigor Trap. 70% chance to cause enemy, to, uh, enemy gun to become a ghostly ally for a few seconds. But how do I go? There we go. So, Firebird. This is it. Jumping from Skyline. Okay. So, you know what? We're going to equip that one. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense now. Beautiful. Okie dokie. Do I need salts? No. And we're going to head this way. Okay. That was semi disgusting. Wow. Kind of cool at the same time. Jeez. Oh, check it out. Lady, let me pass your day. Oh, I am scared. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did I get him? Nope. Haha. -ha. What's this? New kind of vigor? Here goes nothing. Oh. Oh, let me guess. I get to control those guys? Murder of crows. Nice. Oh, murderous crows. Hold and release to create a nest trap. Oh, yeah. I'm already equipped. So press the right mouse button to summon murderous crows to stun and damage your enemies. Hold and release right mouse button to create a nest trap. Enemies take more damage during a crow attacks. Nice. Stop them! Interesting. Let's see, let's see. Loved it. Yeah, that's great. I love that one. Okay, I'm just checking around the surrounding area just to make sure I don't miss something. 
Wow, this game is so good. Ooh. Bad day, huh, buddy? Yeah. You too. Search corpse. Nice. What do we got here? New hat, burning halo. 70% chance that a melee target is set ablaze. Victim takes 300 damage over 4 seconds. Let's take the gear. This is dead. Not working. Oh. Oh. Careful. The false shepherd, this anarchist, is either a Murano dwarf or a Frenchman with a missing left eye. No more than four foot and nine inches. I can get to Monument Island from that station. Go to the Gondola station. Ooh, this has got to be the coolest way to travel. I'm gonna go down there and search it. I, I'm, I know I'm pretty much supposed to go that way, I'm pretty sure, and then down there. But I'm gonna search that area. Is there anything here? Let's go check this out. No. No. Oh, yeah. Go down there. Oh, that is, that is so cool. You know, when I first read about the Skyrail system, I hadn't watched any videos. I was thinking, or, you know, these things. Yeah, space. I guess that's not the Skyrail, but I had no idea that was in the game, and I find that to be so much fun. Am I even supposed to go this way? Go that way. Can't go that way. They're trying to describe me. Are they trying to describe me? Afraid, aren't you? You should be. All right, let's head back out because it doesn't look like there's any other place to go. And uh, you, you tell the story of what you saw here. Oh, wait, whoa! Am I locked in here now? Oh, no, no, I came from upstairs. Duh. <laughs> wow, that's awesome.
Huh. Cool. <clears throat> Nothing more. Okay. Looks like this is the way. Leave area. Enter. Alright guys, I am going to end the episode at this point. I hope you enjoyed it. I had a blast. I'm having a lot of fun with this game and going to keep going. <clears throat> so I'm going to end it right here and uh, we will be back next time. Bye-bye. Rapture can become your city as well.